Elon Musk has just made a game-changing announcement for the Starship program, coinciding with one of SpaceX's most impressive milestones to date, catching a super-heavy booster in midair. How will this bold move redefine the future of space travel? Stay with us to explore how this development could transform humanity's journey to the stars. In a groundbreaking moment for space exploration, SpaceX achieved a major milestone during Starship's Flight 5 by successfully catching a super-heavy booster with its launch tower's catching arms. This achievement not only showcases SpaceX's technical prowess, but also aligns with a significant announcement from Elon Musk, propelling the Starship program closer to interplanetary travel. On October 13, 2024, SpaceX reached this critical milestone, recovering the Super Heavy booster after a controlled descent during the fifth orbital test flight. This intricate operation required precision timing and cutting-edge engineering, marking a crucial step toward making the booster reusable. As the most powerful rocket ever built, the Super Heavy booster plays a central role in Starship's mission for deep space exploration. By catching and reusing it, SpaceX aims to drastically reduce launch costs, paving the way for more frequent and sustainable space missions. Building on this success, Elon Musk announced plans to advance the Starship program toward its first crewed mission to Mars, targeted for as early as 2027. This timeline reflects the progress needed to perfect key technologies, including life support systems, radiation protection, and the ability to utilize Martian resources. Musk emphasized that mastering booster reusability was a pivotal challenge, and overcoming it set the stage for Starship's readiness to support interplanetary travel. Reusable rockets are essential for making Mars colonization feasible, enabling cost-effective, round-trip missions. Musk's announcement carries monumental implications. With the Starship program entering a new era, SpaceX is closer than ever to achieving its vision of establishing a human presence on Mars. The Starship system, capable of transporting crew and cargo, will be crucial in creating infrastructure for a permanent Martian settlement. This breakthrough also cements SpaceX's leadership in the commercial space sector. Its advancements in reusable rocket technology give it a significant edge, challenging competitors to match its pace of innovation. Furthermore, the reduced costs of reusability open doors to new collaborations with governments and private enterprises for missions ranging from lunar exploration and asteroid mining to space tourism. The Starship program's rapid progress is not just a leap forward for SpaceX, but a transformative step for humanity's future in space. What is SpaceX's Mechazilla, and how does it work? SpaceX's Mechazilla is a groundbreaking robotic system designed to catch the Super Heavy booster in midair as it returns to Earth after a launch. Unlike traditional methods that rely on landing legs or ground-based systems, Mechazilla streamlines the recovery process, enabling rapid turnaround for rocket reuse. This innovative system is integrated into the orbital launch tower at SpaceX's Starbase in Boca Chica, Texas, standing hundreds of feet tall and equipped with two massive chopstick arms. These arms are the key to the system's functionality. How does Mechazilla catch the booster? The chopstick arms, mounted on vertical tracks along the tower, are movable and hinge-like. They adjust their position to intercept the booster precisely as it descends. This process is fully automated, relying on advanced sensors and software to coordinate timing and positioning. The arms gently cradle the booster at two structural catch points, ensuring no damage occurs during the catch. After launching the Starship into space, the Super Heavy booster separates and begins its return to Earth. It uses grid fins to steer toward the launch tower and reignites its Raptor engines to slow down for a controlled descent. At this point, the chopsticks move into position to catch the booster. Once caught, the arms hold the booster securely, allowing it to be refurbished or repositioned on the launch mount for another flight. Advantages of Mechazilla Mechazilla's innovative design offers several benefits. Rapid reusability. By eliminating landing legs, the Super Heavy booster is lighter and more aerodynamically efficient, enabling it to carry more payload or fuel. Reduced wear and tear. Unlike traditional landings that involve ground impact, Mechazilla provides a soft catch, reducing stress on the booster and extending its operational life. Faster turnaround. 
The efficient recovery process allows for multiple missions in a shorter time frame, which is essential for SpaceX's high launch rate goals. Mechazilla's role in space exploration. SpaceX envisions using this system to support a high volume of launches, critical for missions to the Moon, Mars, and satellite deployments. Elon Musk has highlighted Mechazilla as a key component in making space travel as routine as air travel. While still undergoing fine-tuning, its successful use in Flight 5 proves its effectiveness and feasibility. Flight 5 Highlights Ship 30's Critical Test During Flight 5, Starship 30, Ship 30, underwent vital tests that pushed the boundaries of reusable spacecraft technology. This milestone test was a crucial step in developing a reliable Starship system capable of carrying humans and cargo to destinations such as Mars, the Moon, and beyond. SpaceX's Mechazilla represents a revolutionary leap in rocket recovery and space exploration, paving the way for faster, more cost-effective launches and interplanetary missions. Detailed Breakdown of Starship 30's Performance Starship 30 is the latest addition to SpaceX's rapidly evolving prototype fleet, reflecting significant advancements from earlier iterations. Each Starship model incorporates lessons learned from prior test flights, and Ship 30 serves as an advanced prototype for the upper stage of the full Starship system, which includes the Super Heavy Booster, first stage, and the Starship Vehicle, second stage. Below is a summary of the key updates and features distinguishing Ship 30 from its predecessor, Ship 29. Engine Enhancements Improved Raptor Engine Performance Ship 30 continues the evolution of SpaceX's Raptor engines, featuring further refinements in efficiency, reliability, and thrust-to-weight ratio. While Ship 29 used Raptor version 2 engines, Ship 30's engines include targeted upgrades for better overall performance. Thrust Upgrades These enhanced Raptor 2 engines provide increased thrust output, enabling higher altitudes and improved fuel efficiency across mission stages. Cooling and Durability Improvements Modifications to the cooling system enhance engine durability, ensuring longer lifespans and better performance during extended missions. Ship 30 retains the six-engine configuration of three sea-level and three vacuum Raptors, now with more robust upgrades. Enhanced Tile Attachment Method A newly developed attachment system secures the tiles more effectively, minimizing the risk of loss during atmospheric re-entry. To overcome challenges observed in previous models, such as Ships 20 and 24, the tiles on Ship 30 were rigorously tested to withstand higher stress and heat loads. These improvements are crucial for ensuring successful high-velocity re-entries, particularly for future Mars missions, where re-entry conditions will be more extreme. Structural Upgrades – Reinforced Design Ship 30's structure has been strengthened to endure the intense stresses of ascent, re-entry, and landing. Enhanced bulkheads and internal supports allow it to handle demanding maneuvers like booster separation and re-entry flips. Improved tank insulation. The upgraded insulation better protects cryogenic methane and liquid oxygen tanks, ensuring fuel stability during long-duration missions to the Moon or Mars. With these improvements, Ship 30 represents a significant step towards SpaceX's goal of creating a fully reusable spacecraft capable of rapid turnaround between missions. Each enhancement brings the Starship system closer to its vision of supporting humanity's expansion into space. Aerodynamic Enhancements and Key Upgrades in Ship 30 Aerodynamic improvements were a major focus for Ship 30. Using data from previous tests, SpaceX introduced incremental changes to enhance stability during ascent and descent. Upgraded hydraulics and control systems for the flaps allowed for smoother, more precise adjustments during atmospheric entry, ensuring stable flight and proper landing orientation. Optimized flight surfaces minimized drag and boosted efficiency. While significant updates to avionics and flight control software improved automation for complex maneuvers, including booster separation and landing, new landing algorithms equipped Ship 30 to handle rapid descent adjustments with precision, setting the stage for future landings requiring even greater accuracy. These software enhancements were essential for enabling autonomous operations across all mission phases, from engine reignitions to orbital adjustments and landings. Weight Reductions and Material Advancements To further improve performance, Ship 30 achieved incremental weight reductions, 
compared to Ship 29, enhancing payload capacity and fuel efficiency. Advances in stainless steel construction reduced weight without compromising strength. Streamlined internal components, such as fuel pumps, plumbing, and electronics, contributed to improved efficiency and overall capability.